Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager. And in this video, we're gonna talk about recent event widget. So previously we showed you how to configure the upcoming event widget. And today we're gonna go into the same path, but with the recent event widget. So let's get started. And firstly, we're gonna open our front end site in new tab. And as always, we're gonna place the event widget in the sidebar but feel free to place the widget wherever you like wherever your theme supports and widget so it's not only limited for the sidebar since we have a bare minimum template over here then we can use the sidebar for the demonstration so let's go ahead and get on with that so let's go to our dashboard and we will go to the widget section under appearance and we will find the upcoming uh, events widget over here so that should be uh, towards the bottom side as this widgets over here are shorted by alphabet yeah right there okay so now we can click that and choose the sidebar and click on add widget so as you can see the theme does allows us to add front page widgets to the footer section as well but let's add it to sidebar and we will configure it shortly okay right here we have the widget let's drag it right up to the search bar and now we can uh, filter the upcoming events by three parameters uh, we can choose how many uh, events to show in the widget the order either it's ascending or descending and we can choose what to use for the ordering so either it's title id name last modified parent event or even start date or even random right so this is automatically saved we can actually reload this page over here and that will actually list out the events over here as you can see they are all being listed over here but uh, you might ask Sarah, this doesn't look really good since uh, we have to scroll down a little bit for the all events view uh yeah i know that and we are working on a pagination method for the uh, event widget over here that will either let you choose pagination or hide it so that means you can even like uh, use this uh, widget as a slider or uh, you can like scroll down for a non slider list view okay so this is the principle how it works so let's say we want to show like three events yeah so we can save changes and reload this page and that will take effect immediately okay so that's the uh, order by title we can choose even random and then we will reload our page so this is randomized event being showed over here on an upcoming basis I hope this video gave you a bit of idea what the upcoming event widgets are or how to configure it. So being that said, that's pretty much the end of this video. I hope you found something useful. If you did, leave a like, subscribe to the channel. Until then, I'm Sharad saying goodbye. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.